What if an air conditioner it was not an air conditioner, but a water heater? Anyway, so what I've done is I have removed these two fans where the outside used to be, and instead of running it into the deep, uh, the, not deep view tactic, the phase change material, uh, what I've done is I'm actually running it into a tank of water. You can see it's steaming in here. And I've run some calculations. I'll add these to the video, but it's able to hit 160 to 170. Uh, I haven't quite figured out the exact sort of reached a peak and then is now dropping off as it runs, but it heats beautifully. Calculations actually show it above 100% efficiency since it's acting as a heat pump, taking, you know, heat from the air in, in the room and then transferring that to the water. Uh, when I run it the other way by switching that to hot, uh, it actually runs as a heater for quite some time. So, and then this end only gets to about 100 degrees, 105 uh, it runs for several hours though. So anyway, so I believe Peltier junctions might be more appropriately used as heaters than as cooling elements. Uh, as they're moving the heat, there's some inefficiencies and stuff. But overall, it's actually better than just having a you know 250 watt resistive heater. So I think I've got a really good off grid solar uh, water heater here. So anyway, like and subscribe.